Hey guys, welcome back to Josh's Kitchen. Today's video is sponsored by Waitrin Spring Roll Shells. Today we're gonna be making two dishes. The first dish we're gonna make is obviously the classic deep fried spring roll. And the second one we're gonna make is going to be my personal favorite, a beef curry pocket. I've had it once in Taiwan and it was absolutely incredible. So yeah, you know what? Let's get started. Get our spring roll shell. And uh, I defrost these for 30 minutes uh, already in room temperature. The cooking instructions that they have is deep fry wrap spring rolls at 350 Fahrenheit for three to four minutes on both sides for even color. When spring rolls are golden brown, they are ready to serve. You know, the golden brown ones are usually the best ones anyways. So first things first, we're gonna have to make a uh, spring roll filling. We're gonna have ground pork, 100 grams. This is the pork that I got. Here you go. Cabbage, I've had here shredded around uh, 150 grams. And the next we're gonna do is carrot shredded. I have here carrot shredded, 30 grams, around two tablespoons. And after that, we're gonna put a vermicelli. You know, I didn't know vermicelli was rice um, noodles until like today. And for vermicelli, you wanna get it to work is you have to soak it in water for 15 minutes and 20 minutes. Sweet onion shredded, two tablespoons, pre-shredded. Egg. Oyster sauce, one tablespoon. So I'm gonna do one tablespoon. A soy sauce, one tablespoon. Those are soy sauce. And next we have salt. I have sugar here as well. Pepper, black pepper. Finally, I have sesame oil, one tablespoon. I have a tablespoon. And then what you're gonna do is you wanna mince it together. Mince it up, get them all nice and juicy. You grab a piece. Wonderful way, Trent, spring roll shells. Here you go, I'm gonna grab a spoonful. Beautiful, okay. Roll it again, remember. Fold it. Rolling it in. And then you have your beautiful spring roll. We actually made it, guys. Put them on the side and just make a few more. While I'm doing this, I'm gonna start prepping this up. You can use vegetable oil. Beautiful. Now we got six. I think six is a really good amount for now. We're gonna place them in. Gently, gently. Oh my God, it's happening. Guys, that is all for our spring rolls. Uh, we're gonna try them out later. Do a good job, guys! Yay! Okay, I'm gonna make a few more, and then uh, we're gonna go right back into our beef curry pocket. Hey guys, we're back now with the beef curry pocket. First is, uh, we're gonna have to, in a saucepan, add vegetable oil. Chopped onions, around 80 grams of it. Oh, it is hot enough, Jeez. 150 grams of ground beef, and it goes. Wow! Cook for two minutes. Ooh, I can smell it. Smells good. So I'm gonna add water, but not that much. Next, we're gonna add one tablespoon of sugar. Okay, that might be a little more. So, sauce, one tablespoon. Okay. Uh, curry powder, which is two tablespoons. That is like two tablespoons. Here we go. Wow, it smells incredible, guys. So, we have to make it two to three minutes. Add a mixture of water. We're gonna add one tablespoon of cornstarch. I'm gonna pour it in. All right, I think it's thickened enough. So now we are done with this process. I'm gonna bring the first one out. Grab one tablespoon, turn in the middle. All right, and then you move it on the side. Again, these are Waitrin spring roll shells that we're using. Okay, dab some of your egg on it. Sprinkle some Sesame Street on it. Oh yeah, that was beautiful. Ta-da! We're gonna be putting it in for 20 minutes. All right, guys, we're finally done. First, I'm gonna try the spring rolls. You can see how it tastes. Here we go. Mm. Oh, wow. It's so good. The crunchiness is definitely still there after it's being out for kind of a while now. I love this. I'm so glad we made it. All right, I'm gonna try the other one now. All right, here we go. Let's give it a shot. Mmm, again. Oh, wow. They're still really crunchy, even when it's not deep fried. I'm very surprised. This is great. Although I have to say it's not like the one I remembered, it definitely is a new kind of flavor. It's kind of more kick in it. But if you guys want, one more time. That's Waitrin Spring Roll Shells. Definitely give it a try. All right, guys? Take care. Oh, wow. It's so good.